Hello, my name is Michelle Stephenson, and along with my husband, Joe Brewster, we are the co-producers and co-directors of the longitudinal documentary film, American Promise. American Promise will be streaming live on pbs.org slash POV, and we are happy to have this national platform to really engage in a national conversation. The film started as a journey of diversity, looking at diversity in action. Our son was accepted to this elite private institution, a college preparatory school that was academically rigorous, that provided a challenging academic environment, but that was also deeply invested in diversity. So we doc documented diversity in action, the, the, the way it would evolve, what did it mean to have a multicultural environment uh, for our son along the way in his educational journey. I'd like to show a clip from the film to create some context. If I, if I was white, they'd, I'd be better off. Isn't that true? You asking me? Yes. What do you think? Yes. Well, at that at this school, I'm not saying I want to, but wouldn't that be? Isn't that right? What this film and this particular painful scene, of which there are a few, there also, there's also joyful moments along the way, is that we are far from a post-racial society, and that diversity is certainly not enough. There has to be more conversation around the implicit biases and assumptions that we all internalize, and certainly around our African-American boys, although this is not exclusive to, to, to their group. We all internalize biases that come from messages that are that culturally surround us or from institutions and their practices. And we think that schools may shield us from that, but they're really just a microcosm of the larger world. So this film allows us to create, to have a story where we can have a national conversation, a platform around the need to become aware and to acknowledge these biases that we internalize and what we can do about it, how we can actually engage in those conversations to create a more successful and nurturing environment where we can really get to know the individual student, the individual child. And in the case of African American boys, this is absolutely crucial because the statistics, uh, we know them and, and, and uh, they need to be changed. And so for us, we not only, we extend the conversation beyond just the film to a book we've written, Promises Kept, which calls all of this information that experts have researched along the way that can help our African American boys succeed in school and in life. And Promises Kept is a great guide for parents, for educators, and for youth. Thank you very much. And you can see the film stream on pbs.org slash POV.